Before doing a front handspring, you should start by stretching out your back, shoulders, and wrists. You should also already be able to do a handstand as well as a handstand block, which is when you pop off your shoulders in a handstand. There are three different ways you can do a front handspring, so the first way I'm going to show you is going off of one foot and landing on one foot. To do a front handspring this way, you should already be able to do a front walkover. Next, practice running into your front walkover. The final step to doing this kind of front handspring is to just pop off your shoulders during the front walkover. The second way to do a front handspring is going off of one foot and landing on two feet. To do this, start by practicing falling into a bridge from a handstand and then standing. Once you can easily do the last step, try to stand a bit quicker out of the bridge. Finally, just add a run and a pop off your shoulders to the last step to do a front handspring. The final way of doing a front handspring is starting and landing on two feet. The first step to doing this kind of front handspring is to practice jumping into a handstand. Once you can easily jump up into a handstand, add a bridge and stand like we did for the last kind of front handspring. Finally, to do a full front handspring, just add the pop off your shoulders. And that's it for this tutorial, so I hope it helped you get your front handspring. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel as well as click on the notification bell so you get notified whenever I upload any new videos. Bye guys!